Hey guys, Blake here from Into Mobile, and today we're going to check out the new S-Beam feature on the Samsung Galaxy S3. So this, this is a feature that essentially adds, puts NFC and Wi-Fi Direct together. Um, it's also just basically a tweaked Android Beam feature, um, and it basically you initiate the connection of Wi-Fi Direct um, through NFC, so it's actually a little easier than just having to connect and wait wait to connect to the other person. So we have our two Galaxy S3s. Um, I'm going to show you how to set it up really quick. So you go into the settings right here and you go into the more settings and you need to make sure that NFC has been checked. Android Beam, actually that doesn't matter. Uh, it should. Um, you want to check Android Beam right here and you also want to check S Beam. Make sure that's clicked onto on as well as Wi-Fi Direct. See right there. All right, and once that is done, you can get your beam on. So I'm gonna just take a quick picture of these little Android guys I have right here. So let's just take the picture. There we go. All right, let's head over to the gallery. Let's make sure that this one is on and ready. No. All right, so now we're gonna beam it. And just like any any Android beam you would do, you just put the two devices on and touch the beam. And it says, ready to send files via S-Beam, separate devices. And then they're connecting and then the picture should show up very quickly. Receiving, loading, and there you go. S-Beam in action. Alright, that was just a quick look at S-Beam. You can do this with much larger files including videos, and, but it's going to be a lot quicker with pictures. But it's a nice step forward for Android Beam, even though it's existing technologies we already know about. Still, it's done in a very nice and simple way. Alright, thanks for watching.